Hello friends, welcome to Raya Raju YouTube channel. Today we are going to learn about water pH. We know pH is the hydrogen ion concentration, but in aquaculture pH is a measure of how acidic or alkaline water is. It's expressed on scale 0 to 14. If that pond water pH is 7, we call it as a neutral water. It means it is a pure water. If it is less than 7, we call it as an acidic water. If it is more than 7, it is an alkaline or base water. In Venami ponds, organisms contains gut pH is a 7 to 8. We all know aquatic organisms or gills are the respiratory organs. If their gut pH and other water, outside water pH will need to be balanced, then only the osmoregulation will be maintained. Otherwise, it will not maintain properly. Factors that affect the pH in pond. Carbon dioxide levels, organic matter, chemical runoff, acidic soils or algal blooms activity. If we check daily pH cycle activity, pH is lowest at the sunrise time. It's due to CO2 building up at the night time. If pH is rising at the day time, it's due to photosynthesis by the algal blooming at the pond. Acceptable fluctuation ratio is 0 0.5 to 1. It is acceptable. It is more than that. We need to take action. If it is pH is very low, we need to add some lime or improve the aeration. It reduces the excess amount of CO2 in pond. If it is pH is very high, we need to remove the bloom or additional add-on of the water. Why it's important? pH affects ammonia toxicity. At high pH, non-toxic ammonia NH4 plus converts to toxic ammonia NH3. Influences the shrimp molting, survivability and immune system. Impacts photosynthesis or phytoplankton health also. That's why regularly every day we need to check pH twice in a day, morning and late afternoon. If your pond pH is rising, follow this tip. Use 4 kg jaggery, half kg pioneer, put it for fermentation. After 4 to 6 hours, apply to the pond. On this fermentation process, this pioneer contains 25 billion CFU multi strain friendly bacteria. Using this jaggery, it will develop and it will help to reduce the unwanted algal blooms growth and this vibrio species. In the formation of CO2, it will become carbonic acid and it will help to reduce the pond pH. For this more informative videos, please subscribe Raju. Thank you.